Growing up, I, I grew up around a lot of strong uh, uh, believers from the uh, creator. You know, they always were people that were sure tall, you know, to, in, in times of need or, or just, you know, like, wisdom, you know, you can call on our creator. You know, like, you know, like, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know, Anyway, I grew up that day, you know, we got for a few years, like most of us, we were going all the way to the You know, forget about it, but uh, anyway, I had parents who were praying, you know, but, you know, they, they, a lot of times we were going out to work, you know, and the crew would be, be waiting, you know, and I was trying to get out early before the son came up, you know, like nice and cool. And anyway, mom would call me in, you know, and sit me down for a We're going, you know. I, so anyway, they laid their hands on me and prayed, you know, and, and throughout, you know, my uh, life, I guess, we have had success, you know, things that, that I often wonder how, how it would come about, you know, but I know it's that prayer, you know, there. Yeah, I was always praying, you know, I was working on over the little ranch operation that he was there with me for several years to advise me, you know, and he was always praying, praying for me, you know, both of them were, as, as well as our church, you know, uh, Stockton's grandmother, you know, we were all over the church there, and they were, you know, they just threw their names, but why do you know, there were a lot of strong prayer words there that, that prayed for me, you know, and, and as a result of the prayers, you know, I've come through a lot. You know, a lot of times situations that weren't pretty bleak. I, I uh, came out, you know, successful. You know, they weren't much pretty dark, you know, at times. And things that you know, we didn't think we could accomplish, we got done. You know, and I know it was in the hall of prayers, you know. Water running, 
turn the key off and on, and all we were getting out there to go get the tractor to the tight so I could go out running. We always pray whenever we got in a little predicament. You know, we always had this hard, hard jacket on his lap. And I touched that. I could tell he was red, but I took off. I got about a half mile away, and pretty soon I was very vehicle. Anyway, I looked back, and there comes a pickup truck the driver. You know, I mean, how the heck did he get out of there? You know, it was a miracle, you know, and his prayers were strong, you know, and I was a recipient of those, you know, and I was very thankful, you know, and I was like another lot of damage, you know, not only this is my business, you know, it was life, you know. He was always, a lot of times, there might be a little perceived crisis, and, you know, you're excited and you're looking for him to, Go back and go to his, you know, his word. Oh, Jesus, I don't get excited. He go to pray, you know, he started praying about things. We always thought, you know, Lord's in the world. Down the road, you know, we settle down. Things come out good, you know, the situation would turn around, you know. So I, I was fortunate, you know, to have my parents there as well as the church. My parents always praying, you know. So 